Hi guys. So, <laughs> uh, I went to the boss floor, and it was hard to find. Um, but I guess my plan is like, like you know how they said uh, he's susceptible to cold. Um, so my my group is wearing like cold gear, and so I'm trying to lure him into the cold room. So let's see how that works. He's like right there. By the way, oh, yeah, get in. Get in. You coming in? Hello. Get in. Oh, shit. And lock him in. Ha 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 ha. Doesn't do much damage to him, though. I don't know. Mm, I don't know. Oh, shit. Nope. Stay. <laughs> Stay in there. See, so you can open doors, but I can just keep closing them. Oh shit. Um. Well, that fucked up my plan. Oh. Well, I'm gonna die. Ooh. He's still alive. That's cool. Oh, that hurt. That hurt real bad. So let's, uh... I might reload the game. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna reload the game. I guess uh, I need to let him finish the attack. <laughs> Dang. Too funny. Alright, let's, uh... Autosave? No. Yes. <laughs> oh crap. Nope. Where was it? Was it the... Was it the autosave? Yes. Oh no no. Oh crap. No, I definitely saved. Yeah, here we go. Up here. Yeah, this is the one. Because I saved in the safe room. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Oh, then. So what might happen is uh, I'm going to let everybody die once. Um, where are you, man? I'm going to let everybody die once so that they're, uh, they'll be stronger against Kurosuke, right? Because if I get hit once by Kurosuke, like, it's pretty much a one-shot kill, and there's a stupid thing. So they talked about, um, oh, I shouldn't have done that, I should have waited for him to wake up. Yeah, god damn it. Ah, uh, god damn it. Well, there goes that. <laughs> Waste of syllabus too, damn. What a shame. What a shame. Who can I put in front? Ugh. Alright, back to the safe room. I no, oh no, fuck, I'm just gonna reload it. That's terrible. Yeah, so as you, as I said before in the last video, like those little things, if you don't let them wake up, they'll do a self-destruct and then it hurts pretty bad. Alright, um... Yeah, at least like to have Rinko use her Silburst. Fuck you. Damn little popping heads. You behind me, bastard Kurosuke? Bastard. Are you in here? Where are you? Ugh. Yeah, he takes a while to find too. Yeah, as I said, I'll let you guys see, um... See me, like... Let him, like, watch him do some attacks, and then what I'll do... I hear you. Ooh! He does, like, a chain attack, um, a fire attack. 
Come on. Come over. Yep, an electric attack. So I gotta attack off all the Cleones. Bye. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what that was there. That's hilarious. Just keeps getting hit. Just gonna stand there. Is this how I beat the game? <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, we'll, uh, we'll see. All right. I guess this is a bug. We just kind of stands there. Huh. That's pretty funny. All right. I'm gonna cut cut it out here. And then when I cut back in, well, hopefully the battle will continue. Or he'll be dead. We'll see. Uh I guess I defeated him. <laughs> uh that was a lot easier than I thought. But I don't think that's the end. Cause I only like cut off two of his Cleones. He's probably going to respawn, I think, but let's find out. Kuroski's massive body is enveloped in Luciora's light as it breaks down into white sand. Did we really win? No way. Because, like, alright, so you saw, like, you know, a couple seconds ago, right, that he was kind of trapped in that, in the cinder blocks, right? So I did that for a little while, while, uh, I healed myself up. But, no way! No, he's gonna respawn. I, I'm pretty sure he's gonna respawn, but... Because I literally only cut off um, his tail, and then I hit some of his arms with, like, charge attacks. Like, no way, but we'll see. Ah, we won, guys! You guys, we won! Yeah, hell yeah! Mina. We did it, didn't we? Huh. He was no match for me. <laughs> Kidding aside, you did great too, Yuma. <laughs> Aren't we getting a little ahead of ourselves? We still haven't got what we came here for. As the others celebrate their victory, I find the key in the pile of white sand and pick it up. Kroski is going to respawn, I swear. Mm. Here's the key card. Now we can get the X key. We just need to take this to the extend machine. Let's go. The group takes a sigh of relief, calming themselves down, but my heart is still tense as ever. He's gonna respawn, right? <laughs> this is the final step. When I have the X key in my hands, my revenge will be complete. What? What revenge is this? Thanks for the people, boss. No way. No way. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna go save right now. <laughs> BRB, gonna save. Because I don't trust this. No way Kurosuke was that easily defeated. Like, no freaking way. Uh, where's save point? Like, no way. There is no way. But maybe I did, because I am at a ridic ridiculously high level, so maybe. But I'm. See? There he is! He's gonna freaking respond. I knew it. There! It's the extend machine! Wait, but. Why is it moving? Because Kroske is gonna respond like right now. Oh, what's going on? Oh, what the hell is that thing? The extend machine here had some modifications done to it. You see, the storage tanks around it? They're all connected to the machine. The clones are created and deposited into those tanks instead of the extend machine itself. It's because the vat in the machine is too small to fit a big body. Anna. Nah, that's not what we're asking about. 
We want to know who that is in the storage tank. Kurosuke. Kurosuke da yo. Umare kake no ne. Kurosuke, so na taoshita hazu ja. Knew it. Shinpai nai. Mada karada ga dekite nai shi. Nemutte ru. I move closer to the extend machine while the others are taken by surprise. Then, I point at the object embedded in the control panel. Mm. This is what you're all here for. It was something we all knew very well. The same X key as the ones on our stomach. So, so. This is the spare X key we need to bring Haruto back to life. Eh? W wait, this is a spare? But it's already set into the extend machine. So done. Yes, as you can see, it's still currently in use. Oh, it's Kurosuke's? With the kill Kurosuke. Oh, do you care if it's pre-owned? Don't worry, I'm sure it's not broken. Oi! Uh, of, of course we can! If it's been used, doesn't that mean someone else's data is on it already? Hmm. Yes, but... Don't worry, you can save over data within an X key. I'll overwrite the memories and genetic information on this X key with Harutos. It's the only way to bring him back to life. Uh, if you overwrite it, what happens to the data on there right now? They die. I've never tried it, but I assume it would disappear. But he's someone none of you would miss. No, 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 no. You're kidding, right? Tell me this is a joke. Miss Minamo looks pale as she covers her mouth with her hands. Kurosuke floating within the storage tank. The X key set in the extension sheets. Yeah, it's just Kurosuke's. They aren't so stupid that they can't figure out what's inside. Kurosuke, or should I say, Yosuke Kurosaki. That's who's inside this X key. No. I take my time before speaking again. Okay. The system for creating human clones reuses the system for turning humans into Cleone. The failures, known as creatures, are born when you extend, but they can't stabilize in human form. These creatures could also be considered a human clone that's partially transformed into Cleone. Daga. But we want to research if it's possible to use this to create humans who have stabilized as creatures. Not as human clones, but human Cleone. Both a soldier and a living weapon. And the subject of this research was... So that murderer. So Kurosuke was not born from your memory. He was born in a clone of You've been making Kurosuke here? So, sir. Yes. I nod in response to Rinko's question, then insert the card key into the machine. The machine pulls the card inside and makes an electronic sound, confirming the X key is unlocked. So, eh? There is a special setting for Unit 10. When a living clone dies, a signal instructs the machine to automatically generate a new one. But since the X key is left in the machine, it's not able to transfer over new memories. But now... I place a hand on the X key, then finally pull it out. <laughs> Kurosuke will never be born again. An alarm sounds and the word error fills the screen of the extend machine. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my. Well, that's gross. The partially bone Kurosuke makes bubbling noises and begins falling apart. Yeah, right? 
even if he's a murderer, like, people should still die it's with human dignity. I wasn't lying about him never being born again. Forcefully removing the X key activates the automatic deletion program for privacy's sake. Oh, snap. Oh, snap, you killed him! With the system domain physically destroyed, Unit 10 should also become non-functional. Non oh. Anna. Why didn't you tell us? Of course Kurosuke oh, will do everything so he can stop us. This is where his main body is stored. That explains why he was more persistent than usual. I thought if I told you first, you might not want to come here. But now we've defeated Kurosuke and successfully obtained the X key. Thanks to all of you that I was able to get rid of that out of control Kurosuke. I appreciate it. Uh -huh. That's enough. I I don't want to hear any more. Uh -huh. Yeah. Let's get back to Garage Island already. Then we can hurry up and bring Haruto back. Yeah. No, you can't revive Haruto. What? Oh yeah, what? Eh? Don't tell me. You lied to us. Ah uh, no. You said we could revive Haruto if we use a spare X key. Yeah. That wasn't a lie. That's why I brought us here to get it. Hmm. So I can destroy it with my own hands. <laughs> destroy? Yare, yare. You all should have been more cautious. Didn't I say I'm the mastermind? Why would you ever trust me with the X key? I raised the X key high in my left hand, then tightened my grip. Yamitoki! Would you mind staying within my field of view? Hey. You're a sharp one. I didn't think you saw me. <laughs> Tiny Zen, what are you gonna do? Stab in the kidneys? Oh, so cute. Ah, oh, adorable. Sorewa. Was this your plan all along? Ma. Even if I hadn't told you. You may have eventually realized the secret of Garage Island and found this X key. So I decided to destroy it before that happened. I wanted, I wanted you all to know what it feels like to lose someone precious to you forever. With that, I activate the clay and I transplanted into myself beforehand. Small tentacles extend out of my left wrist and wrap around the X key. No, don't! Please, just stop! You all seem to misunderstand something, but the content of this X key is still Yosuke Kurosaki. Haruto Higurashi is dead. You know what'll happen if you destroy that, don't you? <laughs> You'll kill me? <laughs> That's fine. You all completely forgot about killing Sachika and lived a carefree life. I expect you would have no qualms over killing me and live peacefully afterward among the six of you. This is my revenge. They don't have the words to stop me. Mm. Sayonara, Yosuke Kurosaki. And sayonara, Minna. More tentacles entwine around the X key and constrict. No. <laughs> Dr. Mamadu. <laughs> Inko raises a grievous cry. But even over her scream, her voice somehow manages to reach my ears. Sachika? Yamete, Her eyes are pink again. Huh? I don't want you to end Haruto's potential. He's a precious member of the Garage Kids and my friend. Onichan? How dare this clone call me that? Yare yare. What do you think you're doing? Pretending to be Sachka now? Do you really think that would stop? That's so creepy. The way she's talking. I've heard it somewhere before. Sachi, did you get your memories back? No way. Could that really? Clone Sachika is a completely different person. She couldn't have retained her memories. I'm sorry I made you wait so long, big brother. I can't breathe. That's right. 
I've been waiting for Sashka for so long. Ever since the day I lost her in that blood-soaked garage. Masaka. Is it really you, Sachika? Why? Why now? Uh. No, I was always here. I just wasn't able to surface like this. Getting over the trauma of Kurosuke must have allowed my consciousness to take over. Could it be dissociative identity disorder? Another personality? But it shouldn't be possible for my dead sister's personality to reside in a clone. Well, I know there's a lot to take in. There's no scientific evidence to back it up either. But here I am. Please, big brother, don't destroy that X key. I don't hate anyone over what happened. Joy, hatred, and sorrow all whirl around within me. I can't think. What is this? How am I supposed to react? What do I do with this raised fist? I know you hated them. Don't you want revenge? Haruto and the others betrayed you and had Kurosaki murder you. Sachika furrows her brow and looks at the others. Rinko lowers her head as if Sachika's gaze had been a gunshot. Sachika, I'm so sorry. I don't expect your forgiveness, but. I don't know what to say. We were so horrible to you. There's no need to apologize. You had no other choice. <laughs> and I got to see all of my beloved friends again, so it's not so bad. Sacha. Sachi. <laughs> Why did you cough? Yamete. Don't say that with her face and her voice. Do you realize how much time I've spent alone in this world? All that time, I lived only to get revenge for Sachika. For you! Thinking back to the ruins we've been through, it's clear to see how much hatred you harbored. And also how much you love had how much love you had for me. But what I want isn't revenge. It's to live alongside everyone. もう君を一人にはしない。寂しい思いは二度とさせないって奪わないで、お兄ちゃん。私の大切な人たちを大好きな仲間を。We just dropped it. I fall to my knees. Lips trembling and let out a wail. I stay there, motionless. She gently embraces me in her arms. Just as I had once done for her. <laughs> An end I never would have predicted in my wildest dreams. This is how plans made by mediocre men always turn out. My revenge story comes to an end. But there's no guarantee it will work. I want you to keep that in mind. Yes. Just don't screw up and accidentally bring Kosuke back to life. Don't worry, I know he can do it. He's got me by his side too. So Yeah, let's begin. All I need to do is copy Haruto's data stored in the extend machine over to the X key. The task itself is simple, but operating the control panel is quite a chore. As I work, I realize I should have brought a keyboard from the hospital. Then I notice something. Hmm? That's odd. There's no temporary data. Eh? Huh? You mean we can't bring him back to life? Yeah. Oh, no. Haruto's data's on there, along with ours. What's missing is Sachika's data. Moshi. What happens if her data is missing? Mm. Nothing, but... It works like internet browser caches and should be stored automatically every time you extend. So, why isn't it here? My X-Key is a different model from everyone else. 
That could have to do with it. I don't know all there is about the Xen machine, but why would they make it that way? Arato's data is on there, right? Let's bring him back first. Yeah. It still bothers me, but I get back to work. All I have to do now is copy the data to the X key. <laughs> this time, it's truly goodbye, Yosuke Kurosaki. I take a deep breath and press the confirm button. A bar pops up to show the progress of the data being copied over. Taking about two hours. <laughs> then, how does new X key is made? Damn, we just straight up murdered Kurosaki. Damn. それ聞くの3回目だぞ、サチカ。また会えたね、アルタ。日暮らしさ、頑張ってくれ。ちょ。Hey, I'm still naked. I'm so glad how to Omena. Don't just sit there looking confused, you ass. I thought we weren't gonna see you again. Come, I am your mother. <laughs> fucking Yuma. <laughs> oh my fucking god, Yuma. She's the best. <laughs> Are you trying to imprint yourself onto him? Harato, I'm so glad you're okay. Uh, what's going on? Oh, did you guys get the machine part in the school? Harato's comment is nonsensical, but I don't blame him. He doesn't know he was killed by Kurosuke, since he's a copy of Haruto from before that incident. Seeing the overjoyed looks on everyone's faces gives me a strange feeling. You're thinking you're glad you didn't destroy it, aren't you? No need to pick on me. We laugh as brother and sister. Dr. Ichio is the mastermind behind all this? Yes, that's the truth you've been searching for. The Xen machine has been complete from the beginning. I deliberately limited its features. It was only recently that I installed the H button we found in the school into the Xen machine. I planned my revenge to be completed once they got the H button, so I didn't prepare an update music. Huh? Everything about the restoration of humanity and getting rid of the aging effect was a lie. Ooh, it was a lie too, eh? And that's a lie. I see. By the time I finished confessing everything to Haruto, I was prepared for the worst. There's no way they'll forgive me after all I've done to them. Guys, I have a favor to ask. I want you to forgive my big brother. It's true, he hurt everyone a lot. But he's been through so much pain too. He was all alone in this world and- Sachika! Sachika, stop. Bokuwa. I still hate them deeply inside. You don't know what I'll do if I'm not dealt with. Mm. That's not true. You're not so consumed by hatred that you kill them anymore. After all the joy and pain you were experienced with everyone. If you were the type who'd still be full of hatred, you wouldn't have hugged me in the infirmary that day. So please, everyone, I beg of you. Sachika lowers her head deeply. I can't bear to see her like this. So, okay. We defeated the big bad boss. And... It's been realized or revealed that... Uh... Um, uh, Mina... Not Minamo. Oh my god, what's his name? Um, the doctor is... Oh, sorry, I'm yelling. The doctor is a mastermind. So, now what? Like, I mean, so Kurosuke or Kurosaki, like his his last boss battle was pretty intense. Like, it scared me every time he like zoomed right towards me, and he had like that chainsaw. <laughs> like, he's one of the other ones that like charge at you, so that's kind of scary too. But like, it didn't seem like. An ending game boss? 
and like it's, I don't I don't know how this is where this is gonna go because he just said you know restarting humanity is a lie, aging effect is a lie. So I don't know where they're going with this, but is there like another big bad that's gonna come up? Like is Sachika gonna end up being evil? Like I don't know what's going on. I feel like Sachika might turn evil, right? Because the extend machine said Sachika's data wasn't in the cache, whatever that means, right? Like, why why is it significant that Sachka's information is not in the machine? So I'm wondering where that's gonna go. And like she said too, like, oh, my consciousness just woke up. So I have a feeling like Sachka's gonna turn evil or something. Oh, but maybe Sachka becomes the last boss. I don't know. We'll see. Sachka. Oh, okay. I already saw that. Read that part. Okay. No, I've already lived long enough. I don't mind it if it all ends now. Sachka. Raise your head, Sachka. <sighs> Even if this clone body stuck in a cycle of life and death originated from hatred, <gasps> I believe it's thanks to Dr. Ichio that I've been able to survive in this desolated world. <laughs> don't you all think so too? <laughs> It's way better than being turned into a tentacle creature without knowing anything. This is just a suggestion, but... We don't have any set objective anymore. So don't we just live out our lives from now on? Over and over again? 13 days? Jesus. The eight of us can live on, wherever our lives take us. Auto 2. Well, you heard our new leader! I'm totally on board! <laughs> yes, but do not forget that I... Yuma Mashiro, I'm the true leader, pulling the strings behind the curtains. Did you really need to try competing there? It feels as if my frozen heart has been thawed away. Thank you, Harato, everyone. Something warm flows from my eyes and my vision blurs. Let's live together, big brother. Together with everyone. Tears run down my cheeks, and I cover my face with both hands. Cutscene? CG? Yeah. Mina. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> I hear laughter. Something about this feels nostalgic. Nostalgic? Oh, here's a CG. Ah, that's right. They should laugh with these kids in this garage. It was Sachka, the others, and me. I thought those days would never end. Those days were always a treat. I did? Why did I use an extend coin? Go to the western shore? Uh, okay, well first I'm gonna save. Oops, save. Okay. So I'm still on stage 7, so what's gonna... What's gonna happen? I'm so curious. Wait, are people dead? Oh, no, right, they use an extend key. Um, let me... Deposit some things. Oops. Yeah, and all I got for a prize was a freaking strengthener from Kurosuke. Come on. No way he's the last boss. No effing way. I and mean, he has to come back too, I'm sure. Why can't I? Okay. We decided to have a party in commemoration of a new beginning. We've been living out here for so long. We're quite experienced with survival skills by now. We get a fire going right away and make preparations for cooking. CG? Ah!
So her voice changed back. Is she not old Sachika anymore? I don't think that's what she says in Japanese. Because I heard her say like yaki niku. And I don't that's not I don't I don't get this this localization, so whatever. So there are two Sachikas inside her. I suppose I explained some things, but it's still hard to believe. <laughs> Harder to believe than being brought back to life from these little X keys? <laughs> I guess you have a point. After Haruto was revived and everyone forgave me, Sachika suddenly tells us she's going to sleep and reverts to clone Sachika's personality. Yeah, I feel like original Sachika is kind of weird. I have bad feelings about it original Sachika. It seems she doesn't have shared memories with the other Sachika, so we have to explain some things again. Ichio, Are you worried, Dr. Ichio? Hmm? About what? Moshi. About the possibility of the old Sachika not coming back? We consider both Sachikas our dear friends, but... Ah, so that's what Riko is concerned about. I feel the same way now. I don't think I ever necessarily hated clone Sach- You fucking liar. Like, you were saying over and over, like, I hate clone Sachika. I hate her. She's not the real thing. She, she's not Sachika. Like, you hated her. Shut up. In fact, I loved her. I spent many years helping her through her childhood. Yeah, out of hatred and resentment, you weirdo. But I was afraid of accepting that and forgetting my hatred and my sister along with it. I see. We never realized. <laughs> of course not. That's nothing to worry yourself over. I'm sure she'll return. I think I actually met her on the day I woke up on Garage Island. You did? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, after you all showed me your excuse for the first time, Sashka also showed me hers. She sort of lifted her dress. I thought she was acting odd at the time, now that I think about it. I lifted her dress. Higurashi-kun! Haruto, you peeked under Sachika's dress? Huh? It, wait, what? Peeked? Yeah, he didn't peek, she just flashed him. Oh, hold on, she's the one that showed me! My little sister can't do such a thing. <sighs> Is this supposed to be a light novel title or something? N now, at least we know it's possible for Sachika to come back someday. Arigato. Thanks for the support, Rinko. Huh? I still think it's contentable that you looked up her dress. <laughs> so, this is what an icy smile looks like on a person. Areda. I don't have any siblings, but do you have a sister complex or something, Dr. Ichio? <laughs> Well, yes. Oi, oi. He didn't even try to deny it. <sighs> but man, what should we do starting tomorrow? <laughs> there are more than just enough. There are more than enough things for us to do. We consume things just by living. So <laughs> Yeah, but I think it'd be good for us to have a goal to work toward. <laughs> then we can start from there. Maybe we can search for other ruins. <laughs> I like that. Maybe there's someone else alive out there too. Yeah. The lower the number on the extended machine's humanity counter, the more accurate it is. <sighs> Aw, can you let us be hopeful for a bit? <laughs> Even if there aren't any survivors, there must be useful tools or something left behind by humanity. And who knows, Lady Sachika here might use it to invent something brilliant. <laughs> yeah, leave it to me! <laughs> I'll study lots and fix everyone's bodies, like the old Sachika fixed that arcade cabinet. <laughs> then we can all make kids together! We'll fill the world- Ooh, Weird. We'll all fill the world with our children. Hey, kids? What are you saying, Sachi? Hmm, you know? I didn't even think about that. We have a doctor too, so why not? Right, Minamo? Damn, Ryo. Getting right on to Minamo. Get the hell away from me! Yeah, right? Jeez. Ow! Doc, help me out here! 
Men, if you touch Sachika, you die. In the end, the only thing we found out is just how much of a weirdo Dr. Ichio really is. I mean, we all kind of did with this whole, like, love spiel. <laughs> You're not wrong. Clone Sachika's dream is nearly impossible to achieve. There's a concept known as minimum viable population. Yeah. So, I don't know if they're going to explain it, but let's see. Okay, yeah, he's going to explain it. The idea is for humanity to be preserved, it requires at least 1,000 diverse individuals. There are only eight of us left. Humankind is already doomed. But still. Yeah, so, um, I know in the game it says it's 1,000. So each species has their own viable population number. So like, for example, deer. I don't know the exact number for deer, but like they, their viable population number is actually pretty small. Like they'll repopulate and be fine. Same with rabbits and bugs. Um, yeah, each population, each species has a different number, minimum number for them to be viable, meaning like they'll survive without having to breed and like if they do too much inbreeding then they'll like kind of just die out naturally i remember doing that in uh in the ecology class back in university but yeah so i guess in the game i guess humans is a thousand i don't know how true that is but we'll see i mean we're not gonna see but like hey you never know maybe it is gonna happen definitely not in my lifetime but you know global warming and all might happen <laughs> I want to believe in those words from my sister. We spent the rest of the night getting rowdy, laughing, and showing our gratitude for the blessings of nature, for life itself, for you and the others being here with me. I can't live alone. That's why I couldn't kill them right away. Even while I was thinking of revenge, because they were here. And I had a reason to live. Because I had someone to hate. What's so yeah, what's gonna happen in the next chapter? There has to be a next chapter. Like, no way this is the end. Oh Moya What's this? Hmm? Is this the garage? I'm gonna fall asleep here. Huh? I'm beginning to remember. Remember what? After we parted on the beach, we took it to the garage and I fell asleep there. Must be from that wine Zen had made in secret. <laughs> Zen, you made wine? That's cool. You pounded through that like there's no tomorrow. There's no one around, and it's awfully quiet. I'm suddenly struck with a powerful sense of loneliness and anxiety. That's right. After all I've done, I can't blame them if they abandon me. If they abandon you, where are they gonna go? Behind the building? Like, they're not gonna abandon you. It's, it's tiny island. <laughs> I sprint out of the garage as if we were set on fire. <sighs> Nina, where did everyone- <laughs> Haruto, <laughs> thank goodness. Sheesh, I endured solitude for so many years, but now I can't be left alone for a few minutes. Yeah. I was out like a light. Is everyone having breakfast already? What happened? What's that foom noise? Mm? I finally realized Harto was acting strangely. <gasps> Dr. Ichio, care to explain that? Hmm? Then I see something I can hardly believe. What is that? Eh? What the? How in the world? What is it? How, how is this here? What is it? The others must have heard me as they all turn around. Come on, Doc. These surprises ain't cool, man. Yeah, you shouldn't have told us there were more ruins. <laughs> ruins? You we were totally shocked. No. It wasn't me. 
I don't even know the corners of that place. I never even knew where it was. I've been searching for it since the world was destroyed, but could never find it. Oh, uh, was this the underground um, or underwater research facility? I mean, I guess it might be. When I think of the underwater research facility, I think of like, what's that show on Adult Swim? Um, not Aqua Teen Hunger Force, but like the other one where like their literal research is like 2000 Leagues Under the Sea or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, it reminds me of that kind of thing, like a dome. <laughs> no dome. This looks more like, I don't know, a stadium? I don't know. That's why I assumed it sank into the sea. What do you mean? Are you saying you weren't the one who moved the island? No. How? It's evil Sachika. Oh, it's Mani. Well, yeah, the underground or underwater research facility. It was Sachika. Evil, evil Sachika. Yes. Alright, so I'm going to end this video here. Um, or say end this part. And I will see you guys in the next part. Chapter 8. Where we fight evil Sachika, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.